Hi guys, I have another Tiny Tidy Tuesday for you and in this video I'm going to clean and decorate the uh, entryway. I'm going to finally put away the Easter stuff. Well, I said I was going to leave it out to the end of April and it's not even the end of April, so I met my goal <laughs> there or surpassed it. No, that's not the right word. Anyway, if you're new to my channel, my name is Michelle. This is my everyday wife life where every day is a fresh start. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new and say hi to me in the in the comments and uh, so I can say hi to you. Okay. To decide what to do today. So, if you don't know or don't remember, I am working on the master bedroom, master bath, the craft room, and the pool bath, aka my bath, for spring and cleaning, deep cleaning, and decluttering. So sometimes I get sidetracked and I post a tiny tiny Tuesday with something else and I'm trying and which I'm going to do today too. <laughs> but I just wanted to remind you and I probably should go like so I have a free pinnable and I have it here hanging in my in my armoire. I need to go and write down everything that I have done so far. I haven't really been deep cleaning, so there's really nothing and you guys can't even see it, I'm too far away. I need to check off what I've done. So let me do that, and um, I need to start deep cleaning. There's really no more, there's nothing else I can declutter. <laughs> I mean, I suppose I could. Honestly, it's hubby stuff, but I asked him today, and he didn't want to, he's not ready. Like, look at this drawer, and then I made this drawer. I've mentioned this before, so if you or another person in your family is a surface has a surface problem i do um do this just put it all in the drawer but it's already crammed so uh it's been accumulating again so he needs to do that and i think there is some stuff everything's all nice and neat and tidy in pretty much all these drawers but he hasn't gone through it in a while and i know it, he could get rid of some stuff so there's that Okay, this is what I have decluttered so far this spring in my master bedroom. I haven't really done any deep cleaning yet, so I will be doing that soon in the next couple of Tiny Tidy Tuesdays. If you want to follow along, the free printable link is down in the description, and you can follow along with me and let me know what you got done. So, um, yeah, there's that. Spring is not over until June 1st, so I'll continue to do that. Uh, the master bedroom, master bath until June 1st. Well, if you're new here, Tiny Tiny Tuesday is brought to you by Sunday Dawn at the Helpful Home. You're going to want to make sure you subscribe to her channel and click the playlist when you're done watching my video so you can get some more Tiny Tidy motivation. And um, other than chocolate, <laughs> that I know can all be done too. He's got quite a bit of stuff in there, but again, he doesn't, he's not in the mood to do that yet. Uh, I'm not going to push it, so I'm going to find something else to do, and his closet needs done so, too. I mean, it doesn't look like a lot, because this is all the clothes he has, so he does need to go through them. I'm going to probably have to just do it. Because he's not, and he doesn't think it's necessary. Well, not that. He just doesn't care. <laughs> Whatever. But these are all his work clothes, and now that he's retired, he's not using them. So that's not like a whole lot of clothes. That's it. And I'm not going to show you what else is in here. We're not going to talk about that. Eh, the rest of it is not clothes. Put it that way. I just shut the door, and yeah. Wait, what are we going to do? <laughs> So hopefully soon he will come around and hopefully soon he will come around and do that. But for now, I'm going to head. Well, I'm going to take a shower because I'm I'm looking a mess and I have to go run some errands. So I'm going to do that first. And my basket fell down. If you want to know, this basket is uh, where did I get, did I get it at Target? I think so. It's so cute. It fell down, so I have to put another hooky thing up there. And I have not taken down my um, Easter stuff. So I'm going to do that and put it away. I don't have another 
thing to put there. You know, this was from decorbox.com. Sent me these things free for a review. Um, I haven't got another shipment. I don't know if they're going to do that, continue to do that. That's fine. Um, anyway, this is all going in my sideboard. So, it's going to go in the sideboard here. A little quick little update. Been cleaning out, been doing a lot of decluttering. Maybe I'll insert some pictures, I don't know, of my parents' house. So, we're working on that. The next step is a dumpster. Yeah. <laughs> so I grabbed this table here. I don't know if we're going to keep it. It definitely needs refinished. This is a chess set that hubby got from Egypt when he was stationed over there for a year when he was in the service. Um, there's some missing pieces. I don't know how that happened. Anyway, and I have a, a Mahjong game under there. Again, this needs refinished. I don't know if we're going to keep that or not, but this is from our house in Connecticut from like... I don't know. It looks 1960s, doesn't it? At least 1970s. So they dragged... Everything else they had in the house was not from there. It's like their second house that they have had since they lived here in Florida, 1978. Anyhow, that is the little update. I did show you all the, the lamp, right? And Hubby's still working on organizing the books and stuff. So, um, yeah little bit at a time. Still doing yard work and all that kind of stuff too. So, you know, just not enough time in the day to do everything. Anyhow, I'm working on my daily chores. Um, so I'm going to take a shower real quick so I can do a quick tidy on the entryway and then show you and go and do my chores and my errands I need to run after that as I am a hot mess. I went for a bike ride this morning, first time in weeks for the uh, walk 30 day challenge. I only did three miles, my knee feels better, my arm does not, but I do want to push it. So I just did three miles, that's it. Yeah, all right, and I got some water and sunshine. Did you, if you're doing walk the 30 day challenge? Anyway, I'm going to take a shower. I should clean the shower room in a minute, but I'm not because I got too many errands to run. Sister and I have been going over to my parents' house and cleaning that out. And this is some of the things that we got rid of. We called the scrapper. They came by and got a bunch of stuff. I took these to a thrift store that actually is uh, benefits children. So I, I don't know how to explain that. But anyway, so we still have a lot more to do. Sister and her husband were over there cleaning the yard up. I didn't do any of that. There's still more to do. Next step is a dumpster. You would love to see a series on this, but there's other people involved, so I can't. So I'm just showing you a couple little snippet snippets. <laughs> anyway, so if you haven't seen me for a while and I don't post a video, that's why. Because I'm over there cleaning up and I can't really film it. But I just showed you a few things that we did. Okay, things happen about two hours later and a trip to Starbucks because we had a little family situation that we had to take care of. Anyway, there's that. I'm uh, not going to go into that, but things happen. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and finish this decorating and undecorating and putting it all away and then setting up just, you know, regular decor in this entryway. So some of you may know that have followed me for a long time that I have been um, trying to get all of my seasonal decor inside the house, get it out of the garage. So I'm finding little nooks and crannies to put them in so I don't have to store them in the garage anymore. And I'm just keeping trying to keep the little stuff, mostly to decorate here on the entryway, maybe a little table scape here and there, but not really big things and stuff. Um, other than Christmas, but I have reduced quite a bit of my seasonal decor over the years. I intended to go ahead and go through the rest of my Easter stuff that I didn't put out this year and get rid of it, but it didn't happen in this video. <laughs> anyway, I did manage to find a spot for a better spot for it in the sideboard, which you'll see in a minute. And at Christmas, I put a lot of my Christmas stuff in the armoire in the dining room but i didn't really organize it very well i kind of just threw it in there 
because I was just done for the season. <laughs> I'm like, I'm done. I will organize that later. So sometime, maybe soon, I'll do that also and try to go through the Easter stuff in the garage. I think I probably can get rid of it at this point. I, 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 yeah, I haven't been putting it out the last couple years and I definitely want minimal stuff for Easter. I don't really need a whole lot. So there's that. So for my regular decor that I put out here, it changes up all the time. But I do have a bunch of antiques here. I have my dad's Super 8 camera, um, a film projector, but that's just in the corner over there because that's not going to fit an old typewriter and stuff like that that I like to put out here when it's not, you know, seasonal and stuff. So um, I'm just rearranging everything and see how that looks, fixing the hook on the door so I can hang my spring slash summer um flowers in that little basket i love that little basket again it came from target i do believe i'll put the link down in the description the entryway table is semi new uh boy did i get that from target too i think so uh, i'll put the link down there below so i've been looking for a two shelf entryway table for the longest time the entryway table i had here was like 20 years old and it came from our previous house and I just wanted to change it up. I really like how it looks and it has nice two nice drawers to put some extra stuff in that I'm not displaying at the time. And uh, yeah. All right, I don't know what else I wanna do here. I'll leave it. I have some space in here for storage still. This, I probably should go ahead and put that in the hutch. Um, yeah, that, those boxes have Christmas ornaments in it, or Christmas stuff that I use to, for display here. I might, uh, you know, like, I just thought of something. All right, done. this came from my parents' house. Um, we've been cleaning it out and stuff, and I still need to go through it all and stuff, but for now, I'm going to put it on the shelf with it. I cleaned this all off. It was dirty and dusty and nasty so I have to decide what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to throw away sister didn't said she didn't want any of it so I'm not gonna I'm gonna keep probably half of what's in there but for now it's gonna go behind me on the shelf all right that's what I got I still probably I need something for the top here but that I don't think this fits right up there so that's just going I'll find something so I put the typewriter up here these are that was my dad's Super 8 camera, or whatever that is. I don't know if it's Super 8, whatever it is. And these are my, is Bob's dad's um, binoculars from when he was stationed somewhere, Japan or something. I have no idea. And I don't know where that came from exactly. And we don't even know where this typewriter came from. I think it was my mother-in-law's. Not sure, but anyway, so I put that up here. I'm gonna get like an old piece of uh, paper. No, I don't wanna put a white piece and then type something on it, like, you know, aged looking parchment like paper and stuff. And then I put a picture of my mom and dad on their honeymoon in there. And then a Bob and I at prom <laughs> in 1981 <laughs> or two. Probably was 80, no, that was 82. Anyway, so yeah, a long time ago, hung up that. Again, I'll put a link down below. I think they still have that at Target. It was really cheap. I know it was cheap, I can't remember what it was. I wanna say it was like $13 or something. That was a pretty good price. So, all right, that's how that's looking. And I'll add more, you know, and I'm not sure what I'm gonna put there, maybe nothing. It's hard, again, it's hard for me to do this all at once. I have to let it resonate and stuff. But then, all of the Easter stuff fit in here. I need to clean the top off of this. Again, hubby's still working on it. So, there's the Easter stuff. And I found a spot for my bunnies, which is great. Instead of in the hutch, because I don't need to be out. And then the eggs are here. And I still have some empty space. I do... But that's Christmas stuff. I do have to, and that's empty. Christmas stuff. Empty. Christmas stuff. I still have to reorganize. I want to put regular decor in here. 
and spraying Easter decor in here. Um, regular whenever it's not a holiday. So I need to organize the Christmas stuff eventually. And um, I was going to go out into the garage and um, go through my Easter bin. But I don't feel like it. <laughs> I just had a little stressful goings on earlier. So uh, I'm going to chill. Okay, so and you're going to get this late on Tuesday. I'm going to chill, drink the rest of my Starbucks, and chill for the rest of the day. No, I actually have to go to Publix later. Or can it wait till tomorrow? It could, but will I? I'm going to rest. Yep. Until next time, guys. Enjoy your day. day. <laughs> Enjoy your day. And don't forget to watch the playlist. Bye-bye. to my channel click my face right here and subscribe so you don't miss another video and click this video right here in the end screen it is the link to the playlist of the tiny tidy tuesday playlist go go watch it go watch it now